How to turn off any running or malfunctioning apps on the iPhone 13. Welcome to one of how to smartphones tutorial videos on the iPhone 13 and 13 Plus and Pro series. Um, I'll be showing you guys how to turn off any malfunctioning apps or any apps that are running in the background. So if you want to, let's say you're using an app and for whatever reason it malfunctions, you're not able to use it, you're not able to move stuff around, it's not responding. Uh, what you're going to want to do is start from the bottom hand, from the bottom. I start from pretty much where it's metal, slide up and right till about gets halfway and then just release. Don't swipe in any direction, just release it and you guys can see these are all my current apps that I have. So let's say that this health app was um, malfunctioning, all I would have to do is just swipe up and it removes that app, pretty much shuts it down, puts it into like a little restart type to where if you go back into it, it'll restart it from the beginning with it like opening. So if you were playing a game, um, it wouldn't take you exactly where you were. It would kind of restart it and kind of go back into where if you were starting it fresh for the day or whatever, it'll just log in like that. Um, so here we have a bunch of the other apps that are open. And let's say we're trying to, uh, you, just to get rid of them, you just swipe up one by one. If Let's say we're trying to get, um, get rid of more than one. Um, as you guys can see here, there's three of them that are relatively close. I can swipe up just using three fingers on the apps that are open. Use three. You can maybe even try to get four in there. So I was only able to get three even though I swiped four fingers. So pretty much whatever you're able to get your hands on or whatever you're able to get your fingers on, those are the ones that will close just by swiping them up like that. So there you guys have it. That is how to turn off or shut down any running app or any malfunctioning app on your iPhone 13 or iPhone 13 Pro. I uh, hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you guys know somebody looking for this information, please do share it with them. Thank you guys all for watching. Have a nice day.